Hey everyone, hope you're all having a great day. Welcome back to Inger Micro's Business Transformation Center and the third video in our series around meeting in conference rooms. My name is Joe Brozek. We're actually gonna be taking off our masks for this part of the meeting for you, just so that those who are hard of hearing can have a better and easier time liberating. And today we're continuing the topic of meeting room and conference room solutions through Ingram Micro. And we're continuing to choose the top vendors in this space of Barco, Jabra, and Plano. This is the final video in the series of three. We've introduced you our team members, a little bit more about the companies, what they do. Our second video, we did an unboxing to physically show you the product. And today we kind of did a mini setup of a conference room, meeting rooms so that you guys can kind of get a feel for how things work, how it looks and how things work together. So just a reminder for you, we are talking about Planar's Huddleboard. We're talking about Barco's ClickShare with the CX50 and Jobber's Panacast 50 as well. So Adam, Joe, for Planar, remind us a little bit about what we're talking about and a little bit about your board, what it does and show us what you got. For sure. So this is the Planar Huddleboard 75 inch model. It also comes in an 86. The Huddleboard has touch capacitive technology, which means that there's no overlying touch mechanism to the screen. The touch mechanism is embedded within the Huddleboard, which leads to a more accurate sensor and more accurate touch features. Cool. Um, so the Huddleboard, if you don't mind modeling the uh, attachments for me, comes with some pens to use for touch. It also comes with these larger styluses that we'll be using today. It has a remote for easy on features and it has a wide variety of features. So if you want to start with the whiteboard feature, just like most displays, um, the whiteboard can be used for meetings. So very accurate touch feature, as you can see, it was basically right on the points that I was referring to. There are multiple options down here for both the pen and the stylus, as well as a wide variety of colors for both. Very easy eraser feature. As well as an undo, so we can get it back. Um, there's also a scaling option in the bottom in case you need to make the screen a little bit larger or smaller depending on what other displays are working with the Huddleboard. So this feature is fantastic. However, there's a lot more to the Huddleboard than just this aspect. So if we want to go in here, Joe, if you don't mind pressing the apps feature for me. So the Huddleboard is also internet capacitive, which means that we can go find the ocean sounds music that I used in order to test out our speaker. So full internet capacity on the huddle board. You can search anything you would from your laptop. You can basically use the entire huddle board as a standing computer so that you don't have to keep running back and forth during the course of a meeting. And in addition to that, we're going to get into how the huddle board it works with some of our other uh, vendors here. So real quick, just to demonstrate, the huddle board also has overlay touch, which means you can make notes on live pages. And there's also a feature in order to be able to save these live notes. So say that you wanted to do analysis of um, a competitor and their product offerings. You could go to their website, take notes on the different objectives that you want to save from their website in order to compare to what your offerings are. And then you can download those and save them in the files on your huddle board so that you have them as reference for a future meeting or whatever you may need them for. So as you can see, uh, lots of different capacities here. We're going to go just real quick. So if you want to save any of your downloads from, you know, live meeting notes or different web pages, anything that you want, it has a wide range of internal storage options. So for the purpose of the collaboration, we're going to go to the HTM1 port where Joe is going to help us show how all of these solutions work together. Awesome. Thanks, Adam. Appreciate it. Mr. Jonathan Scalin, how you doing? I'm good, sir. How are you? I'm great. Thank you for joining us. So before we chat a little bit more and show everyone click share in this meeting room example, 
Can you just walk through uh, what Barco and ClickShare is, how we present, uh, what it's going to look like for our customers when they're setting this up for a oh. solution? Yeah, of course. Thanks so much for giving me the opportunity. Yeah, so as you see on the slide, Barco has two wireless collaboration portfolios. So wireless presentation and then wireless conferencing. So wireless presentation is exactly that. It's like with the C5 and the C10, you can wirelessly share your content with a click of a button uh, or a click of Barco's app. Uh, you can share your content without being on the network. So what this means is like a guest can come in your office and just share their presentation with a click of a button. Super easy, super easy. Uh, and then the other portfolio part there is Barco's click share conference is what we've been focusing on during the vlog series. This is what gives you the uh, option to wirelessly conduct your video conferencing meeting with Jabra and Planar. Uh, as you can see, there are three models that are all 4K compatible, enterprise grade, secure, uh, come with free uh, management software and five years of warranty if you register your device. So and just to keep in mind too, a lot of competitors, uh, when they have warranties like that, they do charge extra and Barco has that free as long as you register the device. So, And then finally, also depending on which model best fits your customer's needs, additional features such as video input, touchscreen support, and interactivity are available as well. It gives, awesome. it gives an idea of the kind of a portfolio of what we got going on right now. Yeah, and I think that's great. You know, with the management software, with, uh, you know, the five-year warranty, the services are always uh, important as well. We also have this slide just to go over how a basic meeting room is going to look with Barco, Planar, and Jabra. Yeah. Uh, because, you know, in the Business Transformation Center, we don't have the full setup. So this is uh, going to give everyone a good idea of what we're looking to do here. With, yeah, it gives uh, you that visual, right? It's pretty simple. The schematic, the ClickShare works in the conference room. And in our vlog example, the ClickShare conference's base unit plugs into the Planar display and Jabber's Panacast connects to ClickShare conference USB ports. You know, so from there, you join the video conferencing meeting platform, whether it's be Zoom, Teams, WebEx, uh, with a click of your button, within seven seconds, your video, your audio, your microphone, they're all connected, sharing the main display in the room without requiring like a full Teams or like a, a Zoom room setup. So it's, again, click simple, right? It's very simple. And I think that's important for today's hybrid situation too. You know, not every end user is gonna have tens of thousands of dollars to invest right. in meeting and conference rooms. So why not utilize, you know, the uh, software that we have on our laptops currently Come into the meeting room, share, you're good to go. You don't need an extra device in the middle of the room. You don't right. need an extra license for that device. You and know? we all we all want to be more productive. So I think giving everybody a, a place where we can spend more time working on what we need to work on instead of spending more and spending instead of spending that time trying to connect to the room to talk about what we need to work on, right? Like this mm -hmm. is really just simplifying that whole process so we can just get down to business. Awesome. Making it easier for everyone. Absolutely. And then what about this guy? Plug and play. How are we connecting oh, yeah. to these devices? Talk about making it easy, right? So three ways to wirelessly connect your video meeting. It's so simple. Click share button. We all know the button. Plug in, plug in the button within seven seconds. You can connect to the meeting. Awesome, right? To the meeting room and your click share desktop, de excuse me, desktop app will detect the click share base unit in the meeting room as you connect to the meeting or as you connect into the meeting room. It's also very easy, right? And then of course, we've got the ClickShare app. Uh, so it's integrated with your workflow calendar. Barco's ClickShare desktop app will give you an option to join your next conference meeting, whether you're in the meeting room or in a remote location. So as you can see with the button and then the presence, the present sense and then the app, they're just making it so easy to get involved and get connected when you're, when you're working with uh, Barco products. Awesome. So this is the base unit that Jill showed you guys previously. It is plugged into the uh, huddle board itself. It is also plugged into the Panacast 50, and there is the power button right there. So that guy stays on, we're good to go. This is the individual click share that is going to be plugged into my laptop. So let me grab that for you. You can see our meeting. This is a USB-C, so I'm just gonna plug this guy in. You can see, it went white for us. It's trying to read everything that's going on. Clicked it, it went red. And now you guys can see our entire meeting right here. So we can kind of run a little 
uh, meeting room, conference room, just like that. We're gonna go back to the meeting itself. So you guys can see everyone that is here in the BTC. And there's ClickShare. You guys can see that we are part of the meeting and we are good to go. I'm also going to turn on my camera in the meeting so you guys can see in that screen right there, we're actually going through Panacast at this moment. Hey, Linz, how are you? I'm great. How are you? I'm doing great. Thank you very much. And remind us a little bit about Panacast 50, a little bit about um, its features, benefits. I can kind of see it zooming in and zooming out as Adam are just sitting here kind of scrolling. So remind us what's going on with that. Yeah, so Panacast 50, obviously the installation recommendation would not be to leave it on um, the table as is. Ideal uh, placement would be underneath the screen directly uh, at the height that you would be sitting at, at or around a conference table. The feature that you're seeing displayed here is called the Intelligent Zoom feature. Panacast has software built in. It's not facial recognition, it's facial, it, it will detect facial features. So what the camera is looking for is two eyes, nose, mouth in a conference room. And when it does detect that feature, the camera will automatically zoom to include people in the frame. So if one of you moves out of the frame, for example, it'll take a couple seconds for the camera to catch up. But as long as you're facing the camera, it'll eventually expand the free field of view to be able to pick up that person in that um, in, in the image, as you can see right here. So as people leave a conference room, as people come into the conference room, the camera will expand or uh, lessen the field of view to make sure that everybody's included in the picture appropriately. And this is very important, obviously, like I've said previously about the camera with social distancing and being able to sit safely in a conference room apart, you don't have to worry about somebody being out of the picture. Awesome. I love it. Yeah. I like our little meeting room setup. Yeah, thanks, Linz, for pointing that out, that this is not an ideal setup for a meeting room and conference room. But just so you guys can kind of get a feel for, um, you know, you can get the wall mount for this guy. You can get the wall mount for your um, planar huddle board. Um, the barco piece can be mounted in the back. You can have it on the table. This is just kind of a loosey-goosey kind of yes. feel for how this meeting room is set up. That's a good that's a good point. So I mentioned previously um, that there are some optional accessories for Panacast 50. It does have the table stand, which we showed in our second vlog video, but there are also uh, the wall mount that comes in the box. And then we do have screen mounts. So you can actually, uh, it'll, it'll attach the Panacast directly to the back of the, or underneath the, uh, the screen. So it's, so you won't have to permanently have it in the wall if you don't want to. Beautiful. Final moments. Remind us, guys, how can we get in contact with you? Um, what do we have going on? Is there any promotions, rebates, um, emails, and uh, phone extensions? How can we get in contact with you, Adam? So for Planar, I'm happy to work on special pricing on huddle boards. I know it's definitely an area that Planar is looking to expand through Ingram. Um, my phone extension is 65111 once you hit the main 1-800 number for Ingram Micro. And I would be happy to help make sure that the planar huddle board fits your direct conference room needs. Awesome. Jonathan, hey what there. do we got going on? What's happening with Barco? How do we get in contact with you? 
Two big things I would say, the, the CX line of Barco products does require partnerships. So I would say reach out to uh, Barco team at ingrammicro.com. That's Barco team at ingrammicro.com. I can go over the requirements for that. And also we have a great trade-in program too. I know Ingram's been selling Barco for a while. So if you have any customers that have bought Barco a few years back and you want to refresh some of our newer products, the trade-in program is awesome. So again, Barco team at Ingram Micro, and uh, I can get you info. My extension is 67203. And I'm uh, again, happy to talk about anything Barco related. So thank you. Thanks, Joe. Awesome. Linz, last but not least, what's yeah. going on with Jabra Panacast? How do we talk to you? So Jabra Panacast is a pretty simple authorization process. It's the same as a regular Panic or Jabra authorization. If you're not a partner today, you can email us at jabra at ingrammicro.com and we can get you set up. It's about a five minute, super simple process uh, and we'll get those parts turned on for you usually in the same day. And my extension is 67078 if you did need to uh, call and talk about anything. And that's about it. Awesome. I love it. Yeah. Thank you guys. Thank you for joining us and giving your expertise. Thank you to the BTC and our engineers, Mike and Andy, for helping us as well and getting this all set up for you guys. Hope you guys learned a little bit and we're excited to set up more meeting and conference solutions for you. So thanks guys. Have a good Thank rest you. of your day. Bye.